In this tutorial, we're going to look at the different ways you can uh, look at your email. So here I am in my Gmail, and way I, the way I'm looking at my Gmail right now is called Classic View. The newest emails appear at the top and are in descending order. Now I can come here to where it says Inbox, and there's a drop-down arrow that I click, and you can see here Classic. I could go with Important first and then important is designated by what Google thinks my important emails and that's these little triggers here show the emails that Google thinks are important and if I highlight you know put my mouse over here there may be a pop-up important mainly because of words in the message so um, I could click and say no that's not an, an important email um, another option when I come here is unread first this puts the emails that I have not read at the top and then everything else. That's a feature that some people like. Another option is starred first. And as you know, or as you hopefully will know, when an email comes in, you can star it and make it important. And you can set up different levels of starring. If you have questions about how to do that, there's a video that talks about uh, Gmail options and we talk about it there. So that's another way you could sort your email. One that I like is called Priority Inbox. And when you click Priority Inbox, um, because I've been using it, it already defaults and sets it up. So if I come here to the Mail Settings wheel, and then down to Mail Settings, one of my options right here is Inbox. And here's another place where I could switch between the different types of Inbox. And then the Priority, um, by default, the normal default is important and unread first. Again, I don't like the way Gmail determines important, so I just simply say unread first. Then in the next group, I have starred emails, so the, the, the emails that I've flagged as something important that I need to be sure to follow up on, those are going to appear next. Now option three, you can either have it blank by removing that section or in this case I have put a label so I could come here under options down to more options and then choose a label maybe I want all the emails from Don Nichols to show in that group and you know, I see all of my different labels for now I'm going to click back here and I'm going to say remove the section so now it's going to be empty and then the third area would be everything else. And then when I hit Save Changes, you can now see you know, Unread is first, then anything that I've started, and then everything else. That is just some different ways that you can manage your inbox and um, hopefully be able to use your email a little more effective. If you have any questions, please feel free to email training at apu.edu.